Hello, this video is going to cover the Moodle project that is due this week. Now, the Moodle project information, and with any of the projects we have over the semester, you want to download and read through the material. Even though I supply videos for you that kind of walks you through the process and tells you what I'm looking for, um, I may miss something. And so always go back and double check, read through the instructions, and make sure the project is done correctly so you get all the available points. Now, the information can be found in a couple different locations. Uh, the first one is in the project information folder. Let me bring that up. Um, on the Moodle site, it says course information at the top, project information folder. You click on that and you'll see the Moodle project is within that folder. You can also scroll down to week one under supporting material. It is the uh, the third project or third uh, link down. It just says Moodle project and you can click on that and download it as well. Uh, what it primarily asks you to do is to go ahead and access Moodle, go into your profile settings, add a picture and a short description. Tell me what you want me to know about you. Um, the Moodle project, uh, of course, is uh, meant to make the distance learning a little bit more closer um, so that when you submit projects, I see a picture of yourself and the project as well, rather than just dealing with blank icons and just a name. Um, it, it's it brings distance learning closer is what it does. And, you know, that's one of the reasons I do these videos as well is um, I want it to be a, a much more classroom like experience. So with the assignment itself, you are going to log on to Moodle and in the upper right hand corner, you're going to see your name in the menu bar. To the right of that is a picture. Maybe you've already added one of yourself. Other than that, it'll just be an icon that's kind of a, a blank figure. You'll click the down arrow to the right of that icon and the menu bar that comes down, uh, the second item is profile. You click on that and it takes you to the profile page. Um, it'll have a box on that page that says user details. And you'll, in the right hand side of that box, there'll be an edit profile link. You'll click on that and then you'll double check your information, make sure your email is correct. And then you'll have a description box where you can type in some information about yourself. And I'm usually just looking for a paragraph, maybe two. Don't write a whole page or anything like that. But, you know, who you are, why you're going to school here, what your major is. General information like that would be cool. And uh, then you can add a picture below. Please don't use icons to represent yourself. Just a regular picture. And you can see on the second page of the instructions, uh, I have an example from a student that I had last semester. That's basically what I'm looking for, and uh, you can use that as a base for this project. That would be worth the 50 points. Point value is 50, and uh, make sure you do complete it because it is 10% of your grade. Uh, the due date is Sunday, June 11th, so please have it completed by that time as I will be grading them during week two. And with that, um, that's it. It's a, like I said, it's an easy project to do. Uh, just make sure you complete it. And uh, with that, I'll see you guys next week.